on Sky Stream. That's right. We going into space. My backyard, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, here is the short story, because I kind of just jumped right into it, because I'm late, and I know I'm late. Sorry, y'all. Uh, basically, I figured out how to stream a little bit of PlayStation content from my PlayStation without using the crap thing that is my processor in this delightful little potato. So, while we are still doing setup, I think Mondays and Tuesdays, assuming we don't finish setup, which is unlikely, but assuming we don't finish setup, will be somewhat of an art night, somewhat of a game night. So that's how we'll treat it. You guys ready for some fun? Let's go. Bam. Ha ha. Ha, it's like magic. It's like magic. Okay, so there might be a smidgen of mega lag, but that's okay. I'm loading my main account, which means we get all the bells and whistles. This is the one I've been playing since, uh, I don't know. Like, maybe Origins? Maybe a little after Origins, like... Yeah, yeah, something like that. Hmm. In any which, great. Here we go. We're going in. It's gonna look like I'm staring off into the sky for a bit, because, uh, well, the no man's guy. Uh, for a bit, because, uh... <laughs> You know, my PlayStation is not my laptop monitor, and my laptop monitor is my camera, and yeah, that's a thing. <sighs> so, a new update just dropped, the Frontiers update. Apparently, there are now new cities and structures, and I have not read any of the update notes, so I'm gonna wander around aimlessly and see what I can learn. That's gonna be really fun, especially because I'm gonna be taking my living ship out for a spin. We're gonna go to a weird, random world and see how that flies. I have no idea what to expect. All I know is... We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. Flying through the sky like little Einsteins. Ah, home sweet home. Ish. Oh yes, this. Okay, I had found a particularly unique world. And, uh... I was assisting my other profile with building. Oh. Oh. Lots of lag. Okay. Cool. It's not, it's not impossible, but I'm actually quite glad I chose to utilize my regular, uh, regular controller here. Um. Ooh. Okay. What are we looking at? What are we looking at? You know what? I do not care right now. I have places to be. So, let's uh, get up in the air. And, ooh, that's pretty. That's real pretty. Okay. Oh, yeah! Pride Month colors! <laughs> yeah! That's the last time I played this game was Pride Month. Yo, that's right. I am an ally. And we go into the stars. Here we go. Oh, I have an incoming message already. What is this mysterious message? <laughs> Controller disconnected. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, suddenly disconnected. <laughs> awesome. I love life right now. That's that's the great message. Okay, we're going to try to get it back and hope that this doesn't happen again. Potato PC, ladies and gents. Potato 
Protegi PC. Are we back? We are back. We aren't back. We are? We are. Okay, cool. We are. We are. Yeah. Yeah, show that. Show that. Show that starship bull crap. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You know you want to. You know you want to. Come on. Work with me, please. Stop showing the scary white screen. Oh, 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 so many things happening. No, this is a lot to process. Ah. <laughs> okay. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna hop into window capture mode. We're gonna reselect um, remoteplay.exe and no, that's not what I wanted either. Bro, bro, I should tell you something, bro. You are upsetting me. <laughs> that one. Yes. Yes, the one with the space. Okay. Hooray. We're back. Though the transmission is infused with static and its alien speech garbled, one thing is unmistakable. This life form is in great distress. The broadcast contains a set of coordinates. Input distress signal coordinates. The transmission's pre-recorded hologram fades as I shut down my starship communicator. Their coordinates point to a nearby planet. Okay, let's go. Bam! May I introduce you to the Elmeth, my living ship. She pretty. She also big heckin' ship. Mm hmm. Yeah. Ooh. I love how pretty this game has gotten. It is not the same game as like 2016, was it? Or was it 2000? Yeah, 2016. Something like that. Yeah. Speaking of which, look at those pretty suns down there. That's nice. This is a heckin' big star system. I don't I don't want the space station. I want I want the thing. My goal. My goal the thing. Oh, isn't this the emergency broadcast? Okay. My goal the thing. Arriving in four hours. Look at that whooshness. Can you handle that whooshness? We so fast. We so fast. <gasps> Whoosh. <laughs> yeah. Okay, not gonna lie. I freaking love this game. It's like space Minecraft. And whatever we run into... It's gonna be grand. Let's run a scan on this planet, shall we? Oh, high sentinel activity. We're gonna kill some stuff today! Woo! In the mood for murder? I am. Here we go. Dramatic entry. See, I tried to set this up sooner so I could have, like, some epic Gundam music in the background, but no. No, we can't have nice things because potato PC. But look at this pretty world. Although, I'm going to say that about virtually every world. Not going to lie. He's pretty. Also, driving this thing is kind of hard. Just because of that slight input lag. I'm getting used to it, but I guess this is what real spaceship pilots often feel like. Heh. <laughs> Hardly. 
as if there were like real spaceship pilots but if there were i mean that'd be totally cool like think about it there are so many stars out there so many galaxies like i was actually reading about cosmic rays and i mentioned this yesterday and it was the most ridiculous thing like imagine this what if what if we just took a second to really appreciate the fact that oh oh that was interesting appreciate the fact that there's this big massive omnibus void out there just full of all these stars in the night sky and we have scientists who can look at and research this stuff till the cows come home and all the while we see nothing no one's come to visit us no one knocks on our door no one says hi earth how you doing or whatever they might call us if they see us in the night sky for all we know that life is somewhere else that life might not even be intelligent it might just be amoebas or it might very well be life like maybe there's some kind of star ocean situation going on out there you know what i mean hint hint star ocean amazing love it love it okay we are here oh disconnected yeah uh, ye oh ooh, tuki tuki yet again okay we're gonna try reconnecting okay come on you ps whore thank you all right and now window capture and let us change it back to remote play ps4 oh, oh. E. almost there almost there I'm getting better at this. <laughs> I swear I am. Ha ha! I figured it out. Okay, cool. Yeah. I hope this is not a common thing. <laughs> All right, cool. Yeah, I think der Wi-Fi is being really bad and stuff. Okay, look at this. Wowzers. That's a whole ass town. They weren't kidding. I. Let's see if there's a proper landing spot, huh? Okay, that settles it. First thing this place is getting is a spaceport. Oh, yeah. You best believe I'm gonna conquer a bunch of Corvax. I don't like the Corvax. So I'm gonna conquer them. They will belong to me. Why? Because bad guy Corvaxes. Ah, <sighs> yep. Here we go again. Don't care. I'm hard headed. We're pushing this. I went through heck to get this far. And if I have to make you guys stare at a picture, I will. You'll stare at a picture and not my face. I don't think it's processing though. I think it's more so that it's just um just stupid. I think it's Wi Fi. Yeah. I might have to do a wired connection next time I try this. Which makes everything different, but hey. You know. down girl oh look at the sparkles mm. the sparkles oh it's so pretty look, look, look how pretty this is 
It's so gorgeous. All right. Ah, oh, hell. Just why you do this to me? As soon as we got on the ground, it was like, I'm happy. Let's ruin your day. Okay. All right. And I think we're going to be doing this like every other minute. I hope not. I really hope not. Done. Okay. Planetary settlement detected. Output status vulnerable. Okay. First off, let's do the rudimentary. And scan this and figure out what it is. Spirit Ammonia. Oh. Oh, this is weather. Um. Need my ship. Oh, yeah. I haven't even mentioned my ship to you guys. Yeah, it's a ship. Oh, all oh, timing. Okay. Okay. I swear if I die in the middle of this storm because of this freaking disconnection nightmare. Okay. Now then. Let's fix that capture window, shall we? So buggy. So buggy. Okay. Although, knowing that I can do this on my actual PC, gonna be real grand. Alright, let's let's get indoors and get warm for a second. Get some of that ice off my butt. Alright. Now then. As soon as I got in that menu. Okay. I'm going to try something. I'm going to disappear for half a second. Bear with me. Oh, I'm invisible. I'm invisible. Oh. Where am I? I'm the ghost of Echazar's past. Oh. Oh. Boom. Ha ha. Sonzai de Haruyo. That means I exist now. Ha ha ha. And now. I don't want it all. Uh, get a load of this. I've been playing way too much Yu-Gi-Oh. I have. It's been happening. Okay. Like, bruh, connect. Thank you. Now, let's see how old bullshit's doing. Ah, e, ah, no, no, wrong thing. Ah, ah. Well, guess what? You guys get to see my setup. How cool is that? Heh. <laughs> I did it. Okay. Now, let's try that again. Summon Kitty Walker. Bam! Oh, I named it after something in Gundam. Zagak. Do you dislike bad weather? So do I. Jump. Oh, I totally missed my target. And it still disconnects? Hmm. 
is very interesting. I wonder why. Is it is it my Wi-Fi network? Is it really? Hence, your internet connection might not be strong enough. So the video quality for remote play lower. Okay, yeah, we can do that. We can do that. So here's what we'll do. Yep. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna go up here to settings. And we're gonna go down to remote play connection settings and oh no that's not it okay sharing and broadcasting uh broadcast settings and advanced settings might not be on the PlayStation side. It might be something I need to do on the OBS side. We're gonna tech support this crap. Yeah, let's tech support it. Mm. Yeah, there isn't an option like that over here. Okay, cool. We're fine, we're fine. Um, let's see. I'm gonna hop into OBS. And window capture. Well, okay. Settings. Okay. Now when we turn it down, things should be much better. Although you guys are going to experience the potato experience, and I'm sorry for that. I am. Cool. It is 100% potato. There it goes. Haha. -ha. <sighs> All right, chat. I'm admitting it. Ekazar is bad at technology. Yeah, that's right. Nobody saw anything. Oh. And speaking of which, I just got a follow from someone named I'm Richard with the H. That was 22 minutes ago. I'm so sorry, I'm Richard with the H. Thank you so much for coming along. I super appreciate it. Say words if you like. I mean, I'm, to uh, I'm totally into receiving words. <laughs> uh, I'm having fun. This is fun. I actually am enjoying it. Look at my pretty red Mac. It's so pretty. I like red. <laughs> I think we figured this out. <laughs> It's not like everything I have is just uh, red or something. Oh, P.S. Uh, four. My ship is also red, although you won't be able to see it through this this thick storm. This is a 
this is a real big booty storm. Like, I've never seen a storm with such a big booty. It's a big booty storm. Are, are you the, are you the guy? Are you the guy? You're the guy. Traveler Entity, you are Vukaza. In time, our Udin's Convergences, Lolorim Bashashacha. This settlement must be the source of the distress signal. What are they doing here? Building a life exposed to the harsh planetary existence? Battered by the elements? I ask about the distress signal. Before I can speak, I hear the wail of a siren. A hostile buzz descends upon the town. The sentinels have arrived. Okay. Y'all want to go? What's up? What's up? We boxing? We boxing. We boxing. Oh, ooh, ah, they're shooting me. More gunshots. Oh. Oh, that's what gun this is. Okay, I understand now. Ah. Uh. This is what happens when you don't know Man's Sky for the first time in a while. That was a sentence. Okay, that's what gun I want. I want that one. The Bolt Caster. Wait, don't I have a gun dedicated to, like, just killing things? Where are the rest of you? No. No, stop it. You're not allowed to. Okay, any Corvax that get fights picked with them by Sentinels are cool by me. Because the only reason I don't like the Corvax are quite literally because of the Sentinels. Yeah! Yeah! The shotgun, though. You like my bullets? I've got bullets. This is the most American you'll ever see me be. Guns. Merka. Merka has rifles. Toxic masculinity in a barrel. Bam. Oh, my face. Ugh. Oh, how did that happen? Oh. Oh, I think I fired my, um, my grav bomb. Yeah, okay. Okay. We're going back, of course. Come on, Elmeth. Oh, she's hungry. My poor baby's hungry. Come on, sit down. Sit down. Sit down, girl. Sit down. We're going down. We're going down. All right, here we go. Um, I am mentally buttoning right now. <laughs> Forgive me. I, I freaking don't remember how to play. It's been a minute. That always happens, though, I swear. There you go. It's like, I don't know how to play, and then I do. And then it's like, okay, let's go. It's because the game is really good, so good in fact, that it eats up your time. Like you won't be able to do all the things you want to do. Everything that matters to you will be absorbed by this. So you just gotta like, not, you know what I mean? Yay, I got all my stuff back. Oh, I got a lot of stuff, this is gonna be bad. Oh, so much stuff. Oh. Okay, 
I need to check something here. All right. That's what happened. Okay. I wanted this one. Geology cannon. Cool. I want a rematch. Woo. Yeah, I got a good jetpack. You like it. You like it. You know you like it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. What do we got here? You. Senor Pantalones. Hablando conmigo. That, that means Mr. Pants. Talk to me. Beverage. Okay. Traveler entity is Tana Panovuko Ilo Peskivi Mokaga Norasulu A A Visales Vitim Worlds are Vedizorchi to Mini Perhaps Traveler Entity will Agrandi Gratsky Kovalum and assist our Udin's convergence. You guys like how I read the alien speech? <laughs> I love it. I love it. The Corvax buzzes grateful for the assistance, but it is clear they are tired, worn down from the fight. If no one helps them, I fear their settlement will not last much longer. Accept their thanks. Perhaps I could assist these settlers the overseer's position appears to be newly vacant traveler entity is tanapanavako ilo sentinel mokanganarasulu e visalis vitimaniko are vodorzi to any perhaps traveler entity will agrandi gratsko vilum and zipevian our small convergence. The Corvax buzzes grateful for the assistance, but it is clear they are tired, worn down. Oh, uh, this is the same line. Okay. Oh, I see. So I'm supposed to go somewhere else. Where is that somewhere else? Uh, here, to the boss house. Oh, oh, it's all steaming. Oh, oh, this is where I blew up, guys. <laughs> I exploded. <laughs> uh, yes, it's so good. <laughs> oh, no. You know what? I should, I should grab these things. How to melee. Um, there it is. I was looking for this one the whole time. Just, there's only a few buttons on this damn game, but I just forgot them all. Yes, I will take the things. Okay. Now then, where was the thing I was looking for that had my interest, as I so had interest in having the interest? Yes. <laughs> okay. Settlement hub interface. That was a shooting star. <laughs> Accessing planetary settlement interface. Access granted. 
current overseer status missing deceased overseer position presume vacant apply for settlement management apply to be overseer settlement overview interstellar signal array increases productivity intermittent lighting failures pungent food cannery no pets allowed what what built on cursed grounds no i don't i don't want this place this is not good the maintenance cost is greater than the productivity i'm gonna go with no you guys can die <laughs> i'm sorry this is space okay and while i am pro space socialism and stuff um no okay i don't like corvax we're going to another star system and that's final dude just no and shooting stars storms oh this is not the planet no oh i'm getting hit by them well lucky me i just so happen to be a mech isa condom i did that so i could walk safely and get on board my ship little elmeth Aw, but this canyon is so cool. And the sky is kind of pretty. Do, do I help this hopeless town? Okay. This could be a redeeming moment for my Corvax hatred. Hmm. Do I help this town? All right. The fact of the matter is, I'm freaking rich. I'm freaking stupid rich. I'm immorally rich. Do you see this? This is 119 million. I'm immorally rich. So, if I were to follow my own philosophies, then it is my duty to help the destitute, regardless of race or creed. <sighs> The weight of the strong. The weight that the strong bear. Let's go. I will save you. Accessing planetary settlement interface. Access granted. Current overseer status. Missing or deceased. Overseer position. Presumed vacant. Apply for settlement management. <sighs> Apply to be overseer. I'll have to learn how to take care of their problems. One step at a time. Settlement management request granted. Okay, let's see. Current debt, 95,000. Time until cleared, unlimited. All right, we're changing the name. Boy Chiego's Crossing? No. How about... Let's call it the land after.
time. <laughs> no, 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 no. We need something fun. Um, how about... Cold Carcass. Cold Carcass Gulch. Yeah, okay, I'll take it. Cold Carcass Gulch. That's what we'll call it. Why are we calling it Cold Carcass Gulch? My simple reason is that this place is quite literally frozen. And the Corvax, they live. Well, they're living machines. So, it's like they have carcasses that are cold. Alright, let's, let's, let's just not pay attention to my stupidity. Instead, let's do this! Whee! I jump! And I landed! Construction terminal. I'll take it. Supplied materials. 210 silicate powder. Easy. A minute and 24 seconds. What's next? Um. Uh. Hmm. Well, if I gotta hang out in a blizzard, I'm gonna hang out inside of my robot. Actually, what am I thinking? There's a whole town here that I own now. So I guess I should learn a thing or two about this and not just focus on the floral or the fauna. All right, so this is a residential looking building with no entry point. Yeah, that's great. All right. Yeah. I'm getting I'm getting mess hall vibes. Yeah, this is where people eat here. Okay. All right. Um Here's what I'm going to do. Just outside the province, I'm going to set up base. And the core reason why I'm going to set up base is because I want to be able to come back to this place. In truth, I don't even need to set up base. I'm going to set up a save beacon. Yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll get into the build menu, which has been changed. Whoa! 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 It's so good! This is great! I love this! Bear! What's the matter, my boy? You know what? We're gonna get in the ship. We gotta get warm. I'm sorry, I'm a cheapskate, okay? Fine, fine, I will spend the money. All right, instead of going up to my ship to call it down, I will call the ship down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I am having a conversation with myself. That's totally weird. <laughs> okay, where are we landing? Cannot land here, cannot land there. Where can you land? Huh? Where can you land? Right there. 
there, can you land, Cotton Eye Joe? Where'd you come from? Where'd you go? Where'd you come from, Cotton Eye Joe? Dee 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 dee. Ah, my construction materials, which are conveniently not right. Oh, that's right. I gave them to my other account. Ah. Hmm. I have a spare void egg. I wonder when I did that. Oh, that was weeks ago. Um, eh, pay no attention to the nip-nip. It's, it's, it's a bad habit. I know. I shouldn't. I shouldn't. Okay, let's look at these storage containers for a second. Yeah? Yeah, let's go on a storage container, John. I need to see if I have any stored up extra metal plate. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. So that's a negatory. All right. Let's get to building. Actually, I already have two sets. So let me just uh, craft a few more and get good. Yeah, we're good. All right, cool. We have 20 of them. And I am going to just consume this egg here. And that did not do what I expected it to do, but that's okay. That's okay. Quick transfer to... Uh... Uh, freighter, freighter, okay, fine, starship, um, I suppose this will do for storage. What's going on in my cargo? Yeah, I'm immorally rich. This is the only time I get to say that, and this is the only time I get to test my philosophy here. So, let's do it. Let's save some Corvax. Yay. I'm so into this. What are you? Communication control unit. It's encrypted. Oh. But we're gonna wait till afterwards. Oh, I have a creature egg, too. I can do gene manipulation on that creature. Oh, I have so many interesting things to do. I have not tried gene manipulation yet. Alright, let's go. Yosh! Good jetpack is good jetpack. Oh, 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 yeah. Supply materials, five metal plating. That's gonna take a minute and 23 seconds. Like, why can't I just build it? Just let me build it. Well, I can go get busy this way. Okay, look. You find a new planet, rule number one. You just gotta explore the damn thing. You know what I mean? If you don't, you're not doing right by yourself. In 
fact. I'm going to change that no pets policy starting with... Who's going to be the one I call, huh? Let's see. How about Mandrakel? Hello, hello, hello! Hi there, Mandrakel. Yay. How's my big beetle doing? Gently pat. And ride. Yay! My big beetle. Okay, I am being a five-year-old. I love this beetle, though. He's so big. He's a big beetle. He's a big beetle. I love it. I, like, don't like bugs, but if they were this big, I think I could deal. I think I really could. Like, a beetle this big would be more cute to me than anything else. Like, I'd pet it on, like, the rhinoceros horn and be like, can you take me for a ride, big guy? <laughs> you know? Like, wouldn't you? <laughs> like, tell me you wouldn't. Like, tell me you wouldn't so I can laugh at that. Big beetle. He's so cute. I love my beetle. Look at him go. Look at... Is that not the most precious thing you've ever seen? Too bad, I don't care. <laughs> uh, have some microprocessors. Om nom 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 nom. Are you are you building building a house? Is that what you're doing? You you're, you're building the thing. I can't go in until it's done. It's cold out here. I really must go, baby, it's cold out here. Got no place to go. Wondering where they left redacted unit. Greetings, overseer. Walks away. Hello. Corvax is Yusa Hazivia research into Aguleb Shumi Kodit Yusa Tuka. Okay, I literally can't do that for everyone I talk to. <laughs> it's fun though. Okay, I might. I might. Unimpressed with life. Greetings, Overseer. Overseer office construction complete. Ah, my office. Oh, well, I've got a nice computer and shit. Oh, look at that. That's so cool. Hmm. All right. Well, let's learn a thing or two about this, shall we? View construction opportunity. View settlement status. Okay, I guess they want me to pick the first one. Approve Starship Dock. Okay, so that means I've got to go to a place to supply the thingy. What what do we need? What do we need? Um, we're building a starship dock. Let's go! Oh, 
all that smoking. This is a nice little town. It's kind of cute. It's got good vibes. It's got good, good juju. Wait a minute. Why is the starship dock all the way over here? Don't I get a choice in that? What? What? Naniga Hitsuyoka. What do you need? Three aronium. Aronium. Once placed, locate the construction site. No, no, I want aronium. Disco discoveries, please. Eee <laughs> discoveries. What do we got? What do we got? Um, no, that's not it. Catalog. Okay, help me out here. Aronium. Is this a new thing? Is that why I don't know what it is? Okay, let's just go out on a limb and try making it. Hmm. Uh, that sounds like a lot. Oh. I don't I don't know what that is. That's Oh. These things sound scary, but none of these are what I'm looking for. Eh. Okay. Where do I find aronium? Let's see. No location services to help. Mineral survey, no minerals. Oh, there's a gas hot spot. I mean, I don't know where I'm getting around him. That's the truth. Is that a new one, perhaps? Uh. Well, in any which case, we're gonna have to figure out where it is and how to find it. Okay, it's worth a shot. Let's go to the space station. Where my 
ship. They're my ship. Up we go. Yes, I just left poor Elmeth. Let's go. Up we go. This is my ship. The Relula. There she is. In all her mighty glory. This is extremely within character for me. <laughs> it's so red. Coming in for docking. Robot. Now, you might be asking, why did I come back to my ship? Well, that's quite simple. My other ships are not here right now. Well, okay. That's interesting. Oh, well, that's pretty. Are you worth my time? Would I buy you? Are you worth my time? B174. No, no, you are not worth my time. Okay. Wait a minute. Did my other ships come? No. Uh, okay, I tell you what, I'm just gonna go ahead and just take my ship. Yep. Forgot to turn my phone volume off. Okay. Well, if we get into a fight, this ship can hold its own. Very much can. Ah, my fleet. Love it. As you can see, I've done some things. Setting a course for the space station, and I'm giving it my all. Even though I don't like the Corvax, because they pick on living ships. And they also do other things. Yeah. Hey guys, I'm gonna go momentarily silent for just one second. All right, I am back. Lively. What a star system. I should be checking this star system out. Okay, we've landed. Alrighty. Here we go. Let's see if we can purchase the thing we need. Baronium. Wow. 
look at that. That's nice. That's a new thing. Autonomous positioning unit, decommission circuit boards. Aronium, please. Nope, didn't think so. Okay, um. Maybe one of you stingy Corvax might have it. Negotiations, Roshiavi, traveler. Hmm. No, I do not see Aronium. This is interesting. Hmm. As a seasoned space traveler, my answer to this situation is to I don't know. Hmm. So I guess overseeing space stations is what this little computer has been for. Okay. That explains a lot. I've learned a thing. Yes, I have. Alright. And you have the same things and none of the thing I need. Wait. Could it be that they actually want ammonia and not ammonia? I don't know. Let's get back down there and find out. Also. Oh, hey! Is that a player ship or is that... Are you a B-class ship? What's your story, buddy? Aww, I thought you were good. I thought you were like some kind of amazing like first gen first gen version of yourself. Yeah. The pod racer long nose is ugly. I say that, but my Gelgug is just as hideous. Alright, let's go back to the settlement. Goodness. This is the far side of the star system. It really is! <laughs> Wow, we are out there. Hmm. Let's try that again, but faster. Wait. Oh, I ran out of fuel? When did that happen? Heh. Oh, shocks. Oh, this ship doesn't have the resources. That's why I didn't want to fly this ship. Because I don't use it for much else than, you know, like carrying construction materials. Oh dear. I mean, it's not horrible. I can just shoot my guns. I blow up some rocks, it'll be fine. Although, goodness, this is one hell of a trip. I'm literally running out of gas out here. There we go. All stop. She is superimposing. I hope my ships are back. Here we 
go. Are my ships back? They are not. I guess that means if I want to use any other ships, I have to actually summon them. Alright. I guess that's fine. Wow, that's one hell of a sight. That is so pretty. Wow. Whoosh. Okay. Ah, uh, Bear is having a tantrum. He does this whenever we're busy and he wants to talk. Because he actually does have a conversation personality. It's pretty funny. Like, I never thought I'd run into a cat I'd want to tell to shut up all the time. Not to say that I feel that way about Bear, but I feel that way about Bear. And then I love the boy. He's such a cute cat. Like, holy crap. Here it comes. This is my main ship. This is the one I do everything with. This is my girl. Alright. Now that we have that, let's figure out where to find Aronium. So, I'm thinking I'll sit in the ship and run myself a Google search. Yeah, because there's Google inside the starship. <laughs> okay, Aronium. Let's see here. You know what? I don't want to run the risk of causing Stream to freak out, so I'm going to use my cellular device. <clears throat> Where to find Aronium? Hmm. In manufacturing facilities and operating centers. Purchase from Synthesis Laboratory for 250 Available from some galactic trade terminals. Can be obtained from frigate expeditions. Can be received after analyzing glowing mineral. Cool. All right. That helps. Okay. Now then. Let's see if maybe there's a place in which I can synthesize here in the settlement. That seems like a rational thing. Mm. This doesn't seem like a synthesize -y kind of place. Let's try another place less arbitrarily arbitrated building of arbitration. This is a very arbitrary building. Look at this, look at this. How do you get into this? Okay, okay. There is some cans. Alright, we're gonna go in first person mode so I can like deal with the nerves i want to i want to look at this properly okay cool cool so uh we have spilled milk of some sort 
I do not see anything of valid use. Dioxide deposit, copper deposit, dioxide deposit, magnetized ferrite, magnetized ferrite, dioxide, buried technology. All right, maybe I should have picked the tower. Whatever the case, here we are. Hmm. Let's see. What's next? Let's try over here. So, all right, I'm not getting what I'm looking for this way. Come over. Let's see. Okay. No clue. Hi. Okay. You know, I'm going to be honest. I'm a confused boy. All right, I'm going to try something else. They said that some merchant stations handle it. So, I'm going to use my fancy ship to run an economy scan. And we're going to go on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. Mm -hmm. Okay, I might like red a little too much. <laughs> All righty. First things first. Starship view, please. Next. Let's Scan for a trade outpost. Well. Oh. Duly noted. Okay. Let's go. Hey, trading outpost. Do you happen to know that, uh, consequently, there's a whole ass, like, town nearby are you aware of that I do have the tritium for this one and I kinda love my launch thrusters oh oh yep the magic of no man's sky folks this happens whenever you play the game on PS4 it just crashes it just crashes. Let's go! You got to see some of my games. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I admit it. I've been playing Mighty Number no. 9. Remember how I said I was going to take the Japanese language proficiency test? Well, that game is in full Japanese, and it's going to make me do my work. Like, legitimately. I'm going to be writing down literally everything. But, 
at least I'll be learning. That's been my policy. I've been playing through the Mega Man X series, actually, personally. Like, just by myself. Oh. So many hours. Too many hours. As soon as I hit the triple digits, I was like, Oh, No Man's Sky is eating my life. You don't even know, man. No Man's Sky is this, this eating my whole life like it's lunch or something. Mm hmm. Space. The final frontier. These are the voyages of the starship Benny Karasu. Her nine year mission is to seek out new life, find strange new worlds, and boldly go where no them has ever gone before. Chuba, da 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 da. I did it. I did the thing. Da 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 da. Blah 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 blah. So you're supposed to get through the loading screen on this game. I mean, how can you not think of that, though? And then, like, oof. The way they improve the lighting on the stars, just so good. And then I'm just like, kerplop. Yeah, good job, No Man's Guy. Good job. Alright, let us try that again. Shall we? Economy scanner. Stairship view. Woohoo! Mm -hmm. This was not what I was looking for. Need more economy, yeah. That's a trading post. Yes, I do fly like this all the time. Twenty seconds out, we get to see the pretty rings of the sky. Real talk, though, I would not like to live on a planet that is completely always frozen all the time. I <clears throat> Words. I do not like the cold. No, I don't. In fact, cold is most certainly not warm and therefore not cool. Wait, no. See, cold is cool, but warm is... <sighs> Good not dab. Yeah, I just made that reference. To anybody who has ever seen Kung Pao into the fist. Good not dab. Alrighty. Let's see, what do we got? Paraffinium. Projectile ammunition. Silicate powder, cobalt, dioxide, salvage data. Oh, this is me. Huh? Huh? Doi. <gasps> Aronium. Yo, I'll take it all. I'll take it all. Yes. Yo. Yo, I'm buying all of it. You don't get to keep any. This is mine now. Oh, damn, I can't do that. Okay. I tell you what, here, 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 here's how we'll do it. We'll, we'll just take most of it. Mm-hmm. We'll take that much. And then, 
I am going to plant a safe beacon here. Mm. Construction. Save beacon. Boom. Eat that. Okay, I thought for a second that I was about to see an exotic rare or something, like an S-Class exotic rare. That was about to just, like, blow my mind. I have an addiction to S-Class rares. I do. All the time. Oh, wait, hey. Look, it's the Power Rangers! <laughs> Green Rangers, like, yeah, bro! <laughs> Yo, do you want to join our rangerdom? Yeah, we'll be Power Rangers. Okay. Yeah. Stronger than the core. Whoa, zeal. Yeah. I mean, I'm the one with the actual Megazord, though. Well, it's not Mega, but it's a Zord. It's like some kind of space Power Rangers. Like, yeah. I don't know. I like to think of myself as a Mega Man in this world. <gasps> Whoa, that's pretty. Okay. I'm, I'm so glad I copied or caught that on screen. That was incredible. That sky just dropping into darkness like that. And then the stars just kind of protrude out. And then the clouds make it perfect. All while we're having this really cozy flight. Yeah, this is good. This is so good. I am very happy with No Man's Sky right now. It is this man's sky right now. <laughs> and the cats are playing. And it's too much fun. Yeah. In case you guys haven't heard, we have three cats. All three of them are engines to the Bini Karasu. They 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 help the Bini Karasu to fly. Is the plot lore? But in actuality, there are three very cute fuzzy kitties, whom you can see on my Twitter, which you should go check out and um, help me get exposure to. Yeah 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 yeah. And uh, also, I should totally do like some kind of weird TikTok thing. I don't know. What's 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 popular on TikTok, huh? Um here we go. Here we go, here we go. What's popular on TikTok? Um <clears throat> I don't know. I don't know. What do Oh, we have a visitor. One, two, Piahoo! Oh, the shadow of my ship in the sky. Yeah, I I might I might be somewhat of a megalomaniac when it comes to spaceships and things. I do I do like giant ships. Greet settlement visitor. <clears throat> a visitor colonist, Thabor, has demanded audience with overseer. They present their qualifications as a flag bearer, shifting their weight slightly as they do. Resolution required. 
allow colonist Weber to join the settlement. Let's see. All right, fine. We help everyone. That's how we do this. We're gonna take care of people. That's what we'll do. Oh. Now let's go check on the thingy I've fixed. We want a spaceport. So Nanashi is working on my desktop right now, and the beeping is making the cats lose their mind, and it's so funny. It's so crazy. Fuzzy creatures are blessings. They really are. I love animals. That's right, I'm talking about you, Snuffy. <laughs> no one heard anything. Shh, I said nothing. Okay. Oh. We got power? Woohoo! Looks like we might be back up and running. All right. So, uh, it looks like we are going to have three hours and 56 minutes for this to be taken care of. So, I'm going to go do something interesting. Yeah. Hmm. What to do on this planet? Like, why did they think wait times were a good idea? What's this over here? Huh? Is this, is this my office again? Okay, I see. Resolve citizens dispute. Operator entity Navici, analyst entity Val. Operator entity Navici and analyst entity Val both claim ownership of a biological patent. Both sides provide documentation. Neither appears uh, convincing. Um, I'm going to pick the pink one. Okay. Cool. Leave to just explore the universe. All right, fine, fine. Well, while that's going on, let's talk to some of the settlement people and see what's going on. There might be something interesting. Hey, planetary specialist Lozen. <laughs> Bro, you have an issue sitting? Welcome, overseer entity. Is that, is that all you got to say? Okay. I do love how relaxing this game can be sometimes. It's so relaxing. Like, I've never known such chill video game. Let's see. Oh, sorry. Not trying to... Not trying to set off... Uh, Sentinels in here. Hey, other Corvaxi. There's supposed to be like 67 of you guys here. I need to make sure you guys are getting help, so I want to get you food. That's what I want. That's the first thing, is handle your food. What do Corvax even eat? Nano crystals?
Let's see. Settlement request alert. New citizens request at cold carcass. Okay. Asking for another new citizen, are we? Well. Regretting leaving the space station? Well, how do I get to this person who regrets leaving the space station? How do I help them? Hey, buddy. Greetings, Overseer. But I can't just, like, help you? I can't, like, Zelda your ass? Okay. A group of adventurous citizens wish to leave the settlement. They wish to secure the settlement's future by uncovering additional water sources. They have all the divination tools they require and only seek authorization for supplies and sundry equipment. Yes, go for it. You do what you gotta do. It's expensive, but... As we work on new things, it'll get better. You just need to believe. Our Shumkit has tear you for one such as your Holovsky. Okay. Welcome, Overseer Entity. You. Traveler entity has betitled MZ Vaviviv by unexpected Zinsky. Convergence is watching. <clears throat> Excuse me. Dinner. I did kind of scarf dinner down. <laughs> All right, we're getting close to that end time. So what we'll do is we'll hop in the ship. We are gonna go up, up and uh, up, up and away. Yeah. We're gonna take it up into the sky and the next time we do come back to this we're gonna see what happened on this interesting new settlement and let's be thankful we had a nice pretty look at what was going on I think I might even post some of this to YouTube yeah that'll be fun
Surprise No Man's Sky stream. A little bit of Frontier gameplay. Yeah. I don't have I don't have a good good song. I'll edit a good one in. Yeah. Here we go. You guys remember Ed Ed and Eddie? Yeah, we'll do the Almondo stink bomb. <laughs> yeah. Landing completed. Oh, there's my ships. Let me introduce you to them. This is, um, not what I named it. Okay, so apparently the names all just kind of did whatever they wanted. Every time there's a new update, my names go away, and it's like, eh. Yep. Like I said, addiction to exotic ships. Yeah. I mean, I only ever fly like every one or two or three of these. Oh, that's cool how it has the green lights around it. Does that mean we're going to have visitors? Is that is that what that means? Just this spot is taken. <laughs> that's very nice. There's so many little nuanced things that they added to this game. It's just so gorgeous. So, to finish off this wonderful, wonderful adventure, we're going to go up aboard my ship. And we are going to take a look at my design. So, on the way to the bridge, which is over here, I set up a really nice garden. Because everybody's got to have their own garden. Paid no attention to my illegal crop of green things that make Gek happy. All the other stuff is the important stuff, not the Gek drugs. Yeah, not the Gek drugs. Oh, they knew what they were doing. <laughs> oh. Okay. <clears throat> Nexties. I'm going to go ahead and hit my save point. Because this will be the end of stream. After I do these things, this is my bedroom. <laughs> the literal captain's quarter. It's where I keep interesting things. Like this experiment. Of experimental proportions of experimenting. Yes. This is a very nice bedroom. Of science. Yes. Why do you not have power now? You should just work. You do. Okay, cool. That's just a game glitch, as per usual with this game. Hey, one thing I can say, though. They made it work. They made it work. Sean Murray made it work. Okay, I'm going to show you the back area real quick, and then we'll call that the end. So, as we run through, we find... There is a hallway, a mysterious hallway, that leads to... Oh, look at that. It's a command center. This is where we do our tactical things. Like, be tactical. In our tactical... Tactical-liness. This is where our... Hardcore... Uh... Tiny lunch lady serves us, um... Igloos. Yes. And then, of course, you can't eat your igloos without your utensils, which 
this is not a gun. It's a spork. It's it's really a spork. It's an aggressive spork. This is a tactical lunchroom. And then this is our tactical beverage bartender. Yes. Yes. His name is um Scholar Entity Uba. And he makes he makes drinks. Yeah. So um and that's all I have to say about it. Oh, uh, uh. and then there's also, yeah, um, lounge rooms to do unmentionable things, um, like lounging, unmentionably. Yeah, bye. And then this is the actual like lounge for the crew that is oddly busy on other ships. Yes. Uh-huh. And this is where I let them store their things, which are actually my things, because I'm the captain and you guys just have to kiss my ass. And let's see. Is my pet here? Yes. This is Eddie. He's cute. He's small. He's little Eddie. Hi, Eddie. Yeah, you're all tiny and squishy. Yeah, he's so cute. Okay, I, 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 I do love me some creatures. I'm sorry. I gotta say it. I absolutely adore me some creatures. All right. One last place I'll show you guys. This was to be the mess hall. I have not finished it. This is, this is supposed to be the kitchen. And then... We have the reactor room. This is where we do our, our, um... Reacting. Look, see? It's a core. It's a core. Look, look, the, the readout on the core. Yeah, I made it look... All space core-y as hell. Look at that. Look at that. Uh huh. That's that's styling. That's styling. You know that's styling. All right, guys. It's been fun. I think we're gonna call it a good night. Mhm. Mm All right. Cool. So, I'm gonna hop over to stream chat and see if. We have any viewers because if we do we can pop in for a raid it looks like we do have a viewer mm -hmm. I think that might be I'm Rika with the H thank you Rika with the H I am going to go ahead and hop over to da, 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 da. Twitch again. Admittedly, I just relied on Streamlabs to handle my stuff, so the information's probably wrong. But hey, we're doing it. We're doing it. Yep. Da, 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 da. I'm heading over there. We're going. We're going. We're going to boldly go and be there and, and go boldly. And, oh, it's going to be so bold. You won't even be able to handle how bold it is because we went there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to go ahead and hop into, because I want to go ahead and raid somebody. Okay. I'm going to hop into the I'm gonna go ahead and video producer. We're going to hop into the stream manager. And hang in there. We're loading your stuff. Mm-hmm. Okay. Hop.
how about the spicy one? Mm-hmm. Startorado. Okay, everybody. Bye bye. Five, four, three, two, one. Rain.